Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to do a quick 5 minute manicure without using any manicure tools. All you're going to use um, related to manicure tools is just a nail cutter. And you can skip that if you have scissors at home, but you do need a nail cutter for proper trimming of your nails. But apart from that, I'm not going to be using any other manicure tools. I'm going to be using stuff that everyone already has at homes as manicure tools and doing the entire manicure routine. So yeah, if you want to know how to do a 5 minute quick manicure without using any manicure tools, then please keep on watching. Now before I begin with the manicure, I do want to thank uh, Saint Botanica for partnering up with me in this video. So Saint Botanica has recently launched their Vitamin C Brightening Hand and Nail Cream. Uh, this contains some amazing ingredients, olive oil, jojoba oil, cocoa butter and chia butter, which are like really nourishing and moisturizing for your nails and for your hands. And the best part about this hand cream is that it is free from parabens, sulfate, silicon and mineral oil which are like really harmful for your skin and for your body and this cream contains some natural extracts it is uh, not tested on animals so it is cruelty free as well it retails for rupees 399 for 50 grams of product but it is always available on amazon on a discount so you can take advantage of the discounts and grab this amazing hand cream it comes in a tube like this which is extremely travel friendly as well so yes with all that being said let me quickly show you my five minute quick manicure routine so this is the condition of my hands before the manicure and my nail paint is chipped. To remove it, I'm using acetone and a cotton ball. I'm simply pouring a few drops of the acetone and removing my nail paint directly with the help of it. Uh, acetone is not really harmful for your nails. It does dry out your nails but if you're going to be doing an entire manicure routine then uh, you are taking care of your nails at the same time. So now I'm using a nail cutter by Vega and I'm just cutting my nails in square shape. You can cut them in any shape of your choice. So after trimming my nails, I'm using the same nail cutter and I'm using the filer side of it. Uh, it's really important to file your nails because you want to get rid of all of the sharpness at the edge of your nails. Otherwise, you might end up hurting yourself or somebody else. Like I do this all the time. In the middle of the night, I scratch my face and then there are marks on my face because of sharp nails. So anywho. Now I'm using Saint Botanica Vitamin C Brightening Hand and Nail Cream and I'm taking just a little bit of it and applying it on all of my nails. You really want to ensure that you use a cream on all your nails before you dip it into warm water because this is going to help in softening your nails and cuticles. So after you dip your hand into warm water, just let it stay there for about 5-10 to 10 minutes. After which you want to remove your hands from the water and pat them dry. Now you will notice that your hands look much cleaner than before. So now it's time to work on the tanning of your hands. For this you need 1 spoon of curd and a little bit of the water from the curd, a few drops of lemon juice and some sugar. The sugar is here is going to act as the scrub. Mix all of the three things well and directly apply them to your hands. Make sure you massage this really nicely onto your hand until the sugar melts. Be sure to massage your fingers and also in between your fingers because that is where most of the dirt gets collected. Curd and lemon both help in reducing tanning and pigmentation so they are both gonna help to brighten up your hands instantly. After the sugar melts just take an old toothbrush and start massaging your hands with the help of it. This is gonna help in scrubbing your hands without using a scrubbing tool. This is going to help to remove all of the dead skin from your hands and it's going to leave your hands really soft and smooth. It's going to get rid of all of the dirt from your hands so make sure you do it on the front and the back section. Now dip your hands into the same warm water to get rid of all of the curd and lemon and pat them dry. You will notice that your hands have been brightened instantly. So now it's time to uh, work on those nails. So I'm using a spoon here and from the back of the spoon, I'm using it to uh, push back my cuticles. Here you require a cuticle pusher. But since we're not using any manicure tools, we're just going to use the spoon to uh, push back the cuticles. You can use any other household items that might serve the same purpose. Now we're cutting the uh, dead skin from the sides of the nails. Here you require a dead skin trimmer but we're not using any tools so jugard. 
नेक्स्ट अब वी आर यूजिंग सेंट बटाने का वाइटामिन सी हैंड एंड नेल क्रीम and we are going to massage the hands with the help of it so you want to take a generous amount of it and apply it all over your hands just dot it all over your hands and start massaging it really really well into your skin this helps to improve blood circulation it helps to make your hands really smooth and soft and it helps to nourish your skin while i'm massaging you can probably see that my right hand looks a lot dull but the left hand looks very much brightened up so uh, the results of this manicure are pretty much evident you can actually see the results all by yourself i've been using this hand cream for the past 1 month in all of my manicure routines and also before bedtime and i've seen a visible difference in the appearance of my hands my hands do look a lot more brightened up than before because earlier they were like really dull looking because of all of the household things that i have to do but i'm really happy with how my hands look now so i'm finishing off the manicure with a nail paint i'm using my favorite unicorn nail paint and i'm going to leave the link of this in the bottom bar and i'm using two coats of the same nail paint for a better opaque finish so yeah with that i come to an end of my manicure routine i think my hands look so pretty now they look so much more brightened up and all this is without using any manicure tools i am just in love with my nails you can see the before and after pictures here and there's a visible difference in the appearance of my hands So you just saw how quick, simple and easy it was to do a manicure at home without using any manicure tools. So the next time that you are in a hurry and your hands are not done and you quickly want to just, you know, do something to your hands to make them look nice and presentable, this is a routine that you can follow at home without any expenses, without any tools which will require just 5 minutes. Saint Botanica Vitamin C Brightening Hand and Nail Cream is an amazing cream to invest in. I use it all the time before going to bed on my hands and my nails. and i also use it in my weekly manicure routines it does help in brightening your hands and make them all glowy i am married now and when i cook i work in a lot of water and that just makes my hands really uh, tired looking and dull and old looking and this hand cream does help me to you know uh, rejuvenate the skin of my hands and to make it all glowing and brightening so yeah that was my video for today if you enjoyed watching it and if you found it helpful please give it a big fat thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel if you're new here and yeah with that's it up for today This is Riya signing off. Goodbye.